We're in Veritas Backup Exec 16. I'm going to show you how to edit the logging. When we go to the upper left hand corner, we'll click on Configuration and Settings and choose Audit Log. So the Audit Log tells us all the different things that are going on with our Backup Exec program on our server. If we choose the drop down list, instead of choosing All, we can choose specific things such as Alerts, which we don't have much of yet, and Audit Logs, etc all these different things. So if we choose all, we'll see all of them at once. However, we may or may not want to see all the different types of auditing that there is. So go ahead and click on configure logging in the bottom right hand corner and we can see all the different things that are checked. Now by default we see that everything is checked except for the append media. So we may decide to go in and uncheck some things such as we don't want to see informational alerts. Information alerts may be more than what we really want to see. So let's go ahead and uncheck something such as the logon accounts. We just don't care to see those kinds of uh, logs that uh, because they're not very helpful to us. Let's go ahead and click OK. And now we're not going to see that particular kind anymore. We can also choose to save logs to a file. So if we want to clear all the logs but we want to save them first, then we can click on wherever it is we would like to save them and we'll just call it audit logs and then you can put in the today's date if you want and click save. Now it saves those files as a text file so it's pretty easy to open up. Uh, we can also double click on any one of these logs and we can see detail about what it says. Now in this case it's not very helpful but we can choose next and we can go scrolling through all the different logs of everything that's happened. Now this is not the same log that you're going to see from a backup job. That's more like reporting and it'll give you all the details to the backup job. This has to do with the backup exec program itself. Let's go ahead and click close and we can clear the log if we no longer need it and we've already saved it so just choose no. Actually, we do, we've already saved the log, so we want to go ahead and choose yes. Let's choose yes, and we see that the logs have been cleared. And now we see a log for the fact that we've cleared the logs. So uh, it's always going to create a lot of logs unless we choose to audit less and by unchecking more boxes. So let's go ahead and close that, minimize, and then we can see there's our audit logs that created uh, earlier. And we, we see that now in a text format and we can also search logs if we want to to look for specific keywords so that's how we set up audit logging in Veritas Backup Exec 16